Compliments of the season, everybody. We are sure you must have had a wonderful Christmas. It has been a difficult period, the last eight months or so, of the COVID-19 pandemic. Our families have faced so many difficult, troublesome, anxious moments during these times. However, there are a lot many positives too that we can take away from this period. And it is necessary that we absorb these positives to lead a happy, healthy, contented life. Let's look at some of these. Good health. The pandemic has made those of us who enjoy good health appreciate the benefits of eating sensibly, good habits and regular exercise which build immunity. It is our duty to encourage others in our family and circle of close friends to do the same. Family is the core around which our life revolves and includes the physical home which provides food, shelter, safety and security. The lockdown enforced stay at home brought the family members together and aided mutual help and understanding. Sharing housework while managing office work has helped spouses understand and appreciate their better house and what they have been going through. Relationships. The lockdown enforced a reflection on the relationships which really matter in our lives. We have learned to focus on family and close friends who count and can be counted on in moments of trial and emergencies. We have understood which of these relationships are really important to us and need to be maintained and bonds strengthened for a sustainable future. This is for good times as well as not so good times. Possessions. Working from home or simply staying at home to be safe has brought into focus the facts that many of us have too many clothes, shoes and other possessions which are far beyond our basic necessities. In the changed world brought about by the pandemic, many of these do not matter in our relationships and interactions with others. This is a good time to give away all these extra possessions to the various NGOs which look after the poor, the needy and the underprivileged who really require our help. There are many in our parish, including Prayatna and the St. Vincent de Paul who would welcome this assistance in cash or kind. Faith. Despite the church premises being physically closed to worshippers, the online masses and other streaming services have strengthened our faith and the bonds of the family who can now pray together at home, both old and young. From the start of Advent, we were kindled with hope as we looked forward to the coming of Jesus this Christmas. He brought the message of peace, joy, harmony and love and we are sure that with his blessings the pandemic will soon be over. It is this faith and hope which enables us to joyfully participate and sing the carols which follow.
Christmas season this year. May it be filled with warmth, love and cheer. No pandemic or lockdown is going to dampen our spirit. And while we honor our Lord Jesus on his birthday, let's pray the new year fills our hearts with peace and understanding and giving. and dancer and prancer and vixen Comet and Cupid and Donna and Blitzen Do you recall the most famous reindeer of all? Oh, no. 
Navidad.